Kanye West's real estate empire is crumbling. In an interview, Kanye West said this. I'm gonna be one of the biggest real estate developers of all time, like some, what Howard Hughes was to aircrafts and what Henry Ford was to cars. But his ambitious real estate goals, including dome developments and affordable housing experiments, have appeared to fall apart. Recently, Kanye listed his Malibu estate for $53 million, about $4 million less than its purchase price two years ago. Another West property, a Wyoming ranch once bustling with development activity, is now deserted, with structures abandoned under a blanket of snow. In Los Angeles, a plot of land intended for West Donda Academy has all been but forgotten. And his Calabasas ranch, featuring a failed dome project, was seen with scattered trash and a stranded dune buggy. Kanye's Hidden Hills homes, including the one across the street from ex-wife Kim Kardashian, also appear abandoned and untouched. Some projects never even got off the ground, including an architectural practice called Yeezy Home, with an aim to make the world better. West envisioned the design as having potential for affordable housing, but since the announcement, little has panned out. Did one of the greatest artists of all time really have a chance of becoming a major player in real estate development? Or were these bold plans just delusions of grandeur?